Friday, Kentucky Governor Andy Beshear visited the mountains to award over $700,000 for regional developments and to unveil a new build ready site in Johnson County. Uh, we, every day, our phone is ringing off the hook at the Economic Development Cabinet. We have more companies looking at Kentucky right now than ever before in our history. We've come up with the best year for economic development that we've ever seen. It wasn't even close, and they're locating everywhere. From CN Agriculture Technology take off in eastern Kentucky, from App Harvest to Appalachia to EnviroFlight, uh, to CN uh, Electric Vehicle Battery Companies locating more in Kentucky than anywhere else. Uh, we're the talk every boardroom across America, and we got to make sure we get those jobs right here in eastern Kentucky. The industrial park, located at Hager Hill, will enable companies to begin construction as quickly as possible. Judge Executive Mark McKenzie says it's a good day for Johnson County. Today we will do a ribbon cutting on our industrial site that Johnson County owns. It's a publicly owned industrial site. Um, and today we'll cut the ribbon uh, as a build ready certified location, which is going to be the only uh, build ready certified location in eastern Kentucky. And so we're really excited about that. This is going to create, uh, open up opportunities for us for job creation, uh, for job, for business recruitment, um, and, uh, and, and really just help us economically overall. So it's a really good day for us in Johnson County. At Pikeville Medical Center, we believe that together we can make a difference in the fight against cancer. We are proud to have patients who have experienced successful outcomes over many years. As always, we believe in the power of faith. Pikeville Medical Center, where cancer can be defeated. Afterward, Governor Bashir visited with WR Fire and Rescue, where he announced $28,000 for road resurfacing and awarded $300,000 for the station's expansion. We've been in about a four-year process to do a community development block grant to rebuild our fire station. It's really old, run down, undersized, you know, it has a lot of problems. And uh, that had gone pretty well, but with the cost and increases on materials and uh, the high wage rates and so forth, the money we had gotten through that was just not enough. And so Judge McKenzie uh, talked to the governor's office to see if there would be some additional funds available. And fortunately, there were some more uh, funds out there for us. And so the governor came here today to present us with uh, $300,000 that we think will be enough to get us over the top on this project. Included in Governor Bashir's visit was $400,000 for water infrastructure improvements in Martin County. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.